everybody, my name is the IT Guy. In this video, I'm going to go over this little article I found on winarrow.com. It's about getting the Windows 7 games, so the classic games, back to Windows 10. So as you may or may not know, when you want to play something like Solitaire uh, on the Microsoft uh, Win oh, Microsoft's Windows 10, uh, you have to get this Microsoft Store app, and it's full of advertisements, and uh, a lot of people don't like those advertisements and if you want to get rid of those advertisements you have to pay like a premium fee so that's not really uh, very handy is it so what I want to do in this guide is I want to go over the the guide that was written on winarrow.com I'm going to show you guys how to install the uh, the older games so the um, the Windows 7 games which were perfectly fine if you ask me uh, there are even some games that are no longer included like Minesweeper of course you can get Minesweeper by downloading it from the uh, App Store but uh, you know those classics they really they really stick to some people and you really want to get those Windows 7 games back on Windows 10 whether you want to have the ad-free experience or whether you just want to have that classic feeling of Windows 7 again, uh, this guide is going to be the perfect fit for you to get those classic games back. So I'm going to include the link for the guide in the video description as well, but I'm also going to uh, ha have this um, the download link for the Windows 7 games as well. So when you follow this guide, you go down and you just click the... Um, this uh, this link over here and this will get you the zip files which you will need so it's going to take you to this page over here you'll probably just have to wait a few minutes here okay so you have to click this link then you can go ahead and save that okay so now open the zip file And now let's extract this zip file over here. So the credits.txt who made this. So credits are due to these guys over here. So just want to say that this is not my, uh, these the credits do not belong to me. Uh, these guys all did it. So let's go ahead and open up the application here. Start installing it. Please select the language. Let's hit English for for this installation. So it's going to take a while to start up. Then go ahead and hit next. And now you can uh, select whatever you want. So you can actually choose which games you want to install I'm going to I'm going to include all of them hit install uh, I'm going to disable this over here because I don't want to go over that tweaker now let's go into the start menu here and let's see let's scroll down a little bit into games I believe games and look at that let's open up um, just solitaire simple solitaire there we have it guys that's been a long time since I've seen this because I've been using Windows 7 for a while now but hey I got it back and it's working just fine as you can see and don't save that game let's see if other games work as well um, Uh, purple place that is something that uh, was included for little children so you can uh, do stuff like that it all still works it's just amazing what these guys did so uh, all credits of this guide go to win arrow and the guys that I showed you in the text file uh, also uh, contributed to this so yeah this was just a quick overview of how to get those simple Windows 7 games back I hope you liked this video guys and if you did please leave a like and a comment below and if you want to see more of my videos please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.